I'm gonna take it home. Believe it or not, that's my brother, no one there in that wheelchair. That's Pauline's brother, John McCoy. Me and my wife had to go and buy him that. Uh, we had to go and buy him in a hockle top this morning, believe it or no not. Way. But sure, is not what it's all about. Do you know, Johnny, I was down at Craigan about 10 years ago when they won a football championship and they also took the cup up to the car to give it to him. But that's what it's about. John will be in there and he'll be in cloud nine now with those boys. About. And, and as you said, you did make a great point. They're so kind and so respectful, you know, those Ahafa players. And they do always come over and give them recognition. And, and the same as, you know, they do for a lot of guys. But they're, um, they're a real family club. And, you know, that's why it's really, really good to see. And I suppose without getting too mushy and too gushy about the whole thing, I think they're everything... They're everything the GAA, I think, should mean to us all. Do you know what I mean about family and friends? Have you ever and, seen and so many babies? Yeah, and that's, well, that's a good sign, I suppose, for a hockel. That's what they'll, uh, that's what they'll want. They'll be, uh, the next generation. There'll be another generation of O'Connells and Grahams and Bradys. And uh, I mean, that day I was too young to be playing, but Chris McGlone, the same thing. Uh, see moments like that, it's unreal. They don't come around very often. Like, you know, we nine years ago we won the intermediate title. Same thing. Uh, I can't believe it, honestly. I thought we were dead and buried there.